So before I started tinkering with the netbook, installing Windows 10 on it, and which, by the way, still works and working really well, the netbook was already um, in a really bad state. Like the hinge mechanism entirely is outside of the body, which I wish I could show you a picture of, but I didn't. So I first started patching it using some glue and then to tape, like really janky repair. It didn't really last long and after a bit of use, eh, the hinge is gone. Like it's really broken, even the other side is broken. And eventually, since the body itself is coming loose, the heatsink came loose. Which didn't really end well, of course. So that, I would like to introduce you is the Intel Atom N280 processor. So the reason I took out this heatsink because I'm gonna put in some new thermal paste. I mean, it was loose out of it. Like it was loose completely. So when I finally got the netbook back, I needed to find a way to fully secure the body like tight and make sure that hinge is not going to be moving anymore. And there are two ways to do that. One, is the proper way with some nuts and bolts and then some 3d printing maybe fix the hinge like the body portion where the hinge is or the fun and quick way and that is using zip ties and a rotary tool also known as a Jamel but really it's called a rotary tool So like is gonna like, hate is gonna hate, subscribe so you don't miss any of my future videos. My next video would be part 2 of that Frankenstein PC I built um, a week ago? No, it was like a month worth because I was busy with thesis and stuff. 
But yeah, subscribe so you don't so yeah, subscribe so you don't miss any of my future videos like Frankenstein PC and other um really cringe worthy repairs and crap that I do. Alright.